a demonstration of synchronized multiple motor speed control using ARM. So, you know, in industry there's a wide need for uh, machinery and motors to be synchronized or to be uh, used at uh, variable speeds so as to achieve the desired industrial process for automation. So that's why we need to control uh, machinery at the desired speeds to uh, you know things that are performed in an industry like a conveyor belt that is uh, leading an object to multiple machines at such uh, stages and in such uh, uh, uses we need to uh, synchronize machines to do their appropriate tasks at appropriate uh, time intervals and uh, that's why we need to synchronize them and also we need to uh, vary their uh, PWM and uh, run them at uh, different speeds. So for this purpose as you can see here we have used these uh, four motors to demonstrate as industrial machinery and uh, they are connected to the ARM Cortex board which is in turn connected to an LCD display and a Bluetooth uh, receiver or modem to receive commands from the user through an Android device and the circuit is powered by a 12 volt power supply. So now let's talk. The system has been turned on now and it is showing that all loads are off. So now let's do one thing, let's connect to the system through our Android device using this uh, application here. So we have been connected, this is a free application which is available online, the link is provided on our website. So now after we are connected, we can uh, use these buttons here to turn on uh, the loads one at a time. Similarly, the other buttons can use to be turn on those loads. And now, once we have turned on the loads, we can now vary their speeds by uh, pressing the button and then the speed controller and the speed of the motor is also displayed as a percentage on the LCD display as you can see here let's increase the speed of uh, first motor and it is uh, at its highest uh, RPM now so similarly let's decrease it as you can see the speed of the first motor is slower than the second one and now it is at its slowest similarly let's uh, do it for the second one so in this way we can uh, vary intensity of the motors and so the machinery can be synchronized and can be run accordingly at desired speeds at the same time So this is how the system works, thank you.